Yeah, that's road rash. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> so, what happened, bro? Well, um, we're ripping down this gravel road and fucking following too close, and there's dust everywhere. And then coming into a fucking like a hair point 90 fucking bend, and I didn't see it, obviously. We'll take a, we'll take a look back here. here. You can see he's lying. <laughs> I'm gonna go back to the road. Okay. Like, you see you see you see you yeah. My line's like fucking straight. Essentially, I'm coming in, yeah, my skid marks fucking hit this. Fucking went over, and now my bike is fucked. Listen, you guys aren't, obviously aren't gonna do the rest of it with us then, eh? No. Well, I'd like to fucking maybe set up camp with you guys, but. <laughs> Fuck. Well, unless we get his, his um, bike towed away, and then he can jump on the back of me. Because it's only an hour and a half, two hours away, isn't it? Probably not gonna happen. Then you got, then you got yeah. a couple hundred k's of going yeah, through the mountains. Out. It's probably not gonna happen, is it? Two, two up, yeah. two up is not gonna be the easiest. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, we're already, we're already coming on this day. Yeah. 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 So. Now, get someone out here at all. Yeah. So. Yeah. Midday onwards, it starts to close down. Yeah. So as the uh, as the workshop manager of my cops cons motorcycles, what's the chances of the boys leaving on Monday? <laughs> None. <laughs> Have not, the, even, <laughs> not even in two weeks' time. <laughs> <laughs> Have the boys just scored themselves another week in Cape Town? At least another, maybe even two. Maybe two weeks? Maybe. No. I don't know, we have to see. That's there are a, easier ways of staying in the yeah. city. <laughs> <laughs> Kenny, you didn't have to do this, mate. You could have just told me you wanted to stay. So the plan was to leave today. Mm. And then you decided to go on a, a two day ride with us through Cedarburg. With Tiger Man Adventures? Yeah, and then. You decided to, to stay a couple more weeks, right? <laughs> Thanks, <Kenny. Good> <laughs> Gareth, when you when you have kids, man, you, we're almost gonna have paid for them to go through private school. Pretty much. Hey, <laughs> spend a fortune. Yeah. That's the plan. <laughs> That's why you invited us out today. You knew this was yeah. gonna happen, didn't you? <laughs> Right, okay, Kenny, talk us through uh, what's the main damage on the bike? Back, the front end, man. The front end? Yeah, let's just check out. Let's yeah. check out which way the steering's facing. Yeah, you'll not, get a nice and then the way the wheel is. Let's nice have a look at the wheel. Yeah. One leg's in front of the other. Is it? Kenny. Alright, we'll come have a look oh, at this. Nice. It's a piece of helmet everywhere. Oh, a twist. New helmet as well. Oh. Yeah, there's a. What have we got here? Yeah. Not much of a mechanic, but no, that's not good. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, Kenny, fuck it, man. I reckon you can ride like this. Come on. Listen, <laughs> my music still works. My music still works. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go back to the road quick. <laughs> Look, there's some All right, nice so I guess, uh, we got Gareth on his way out to the road now. He's got to go and find a tow truck or See, something, or maybe a bucky. The blood stains in my helmet. A ute or a truck is a translation for Australia and Canada. What's happened there? I got some nice blood stains now inside uh, my helmet. There we go. He christened it. Fucking and uh, depending on how long that takes, I think we'll have to get Kenny's to bike towed away, and too. Kenny might have to get a taxi back to Cape Town, which is <laughs> <laughs> a couple of hours away from here. So. Uh, Another change for the boys, another spanner for the works, but we love it. Let's go. Good.